So you stumbled onto mobile home investing. I'm gonna share with you guys three steps to start your mobile home business today. And if you haven't subscribed yet, my channel's about mobile home investing. Please hit the subscribe button, the like button, uh, to get notified next time I post a mobile home related video. I used to be in your shoes. Uh, five years ago, I was working a job I didn't enjoy. Uh, I was waking up every morning, you know, it's, uh, it's miserable. I was, I was hating the fact that I had to go to work. I was traveling for work. I was never home. Uh, my now fiance, she didn't like the fact that I was traveling for my job. Uh, just wasn't living a very fulfilling life. And that's when I found mobile home investing. Now mobile home investing, it changed my life. Uh, it's given me the opportunity to work for myself. Uh, it's given me the freedom, the time. Um, obviously, uh, some people are in it for the money. It's, it's really good money if done well. Uh, in this video, I'm gonna give you three tips on how to start your mobile home investing business today. Okay, step one. You gotta audit your life. You gotta establish your why. So for me, um, I was you know, going to work. I, I, I had to travel for work. I had all these people telling me what I needed to do, where I needed to be, uh, when I needed to work, how much I needed to work. And for me, it was all about my time. I didn't like giving my time to someone else. I didn't want to work for another man's dream. And that's how I, I got interested in real estate. I started looking into wholesaling. I started looking into uh, fix and flips, rentals. And that's when I stumbled onto the mobile home business. Now, the great thing about the mobile home business is uh, there's different exit strategies. Uh, there's exit strategies to make cash really quick and there's exit strategies more for cash flow, which uh, provided the same cash flow that I was looking for with rentals. And that's ultimately what drew me to this business. I wanted financial freedom. And uh, you know, in order to get there, I had to uh, establish clear goals. I had to establish my why. For me, it was my time. Uh, you know, if you don't have that clear vision, that why, what's driving you, you know, through all the ups and downs of this business, uh, you're not going to be successful. So for me, step one is always, always establishing why you're in this business. You know, what's what's motivating you, what's making you hungry to to become the best mobile home investor. So that's step one. That brings us to step two. Step two is actually learning the business now. At first. It feels uncomfortable, man. It, it, it is the most uncomfortable feeling. You're going into a mobile home park for the first time. All my buddies, they were at a pool party. They were hanging out by the pool in Scottsdale, Arizona, you know, having a grand old time. And I was driving through a mobile home park. I felt so uncomfortable. I felt like a fish out of water. Uh, I didn't know how to buy a mobile home. I didn't even know what a deal looked like. And starting out, you're gonna feel uncomfortable. There's a lot to learn. There's, you know, uh, it's figuring out what a deal is, figuring out your market. You gotta figure out once uh, you do find the deal, how to buy the deal, how to transfer a title, uh, how to actually, um, you know, offload it, how to sell it, different exit strategies. There's a lot to learn starting out. There's a lot of great resources. Uh, my YouTube channel is gonna be a resource for anyone that's interested in this business. Uh, there's a lot of other really great YouTube channels out there, blog articles. Uh, you really need to take the time to learn this business in and out. If you're enjoying this video, leave a comment below. Let me know what the biggest obstacle is preventing you from starting your business today. That brings us to step number three. You gotta take massive action. Uh, step two, you're not gonna know everything. And let me tell you a story about how I got my first deal. So my first deal came the day before Christmas. I was out driving for dollars. Uh, Christmas day, I was planning on flying home. Um, the company that I was working for gave us from Christmas to New Year's every single year off. And the day before I went out driving in the very last park, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not kidding, the very last park I drove through, that's when I found the deal. It was a family that was getting evicted from the mobile home park. They were about to hand their keys over to the park. Yes, that happens. They were, they were gonna hand their title and keys over to the park uh, because they were behind on lot rent. And that's when I stopped, talked to them, said, hey, by the way, I can help. At that point, I didn't know anything about mobile homes. I didn't know how to get a title. I didn't know what a title looked like. I didn't know how to do a bill of sale, get anything notarized. I didn't know anything. I didn't know how to sell mobile homes, but I took action and I knew I was smart enough to figure it out. And here I am today. If I didn't take action that day, if I didn't go out driving for dollars, I would never be in a position where I could teach people mobile home investing. So, you know, there's a lot of obstacles. There's a lot of stuff that we don't know. I'm still learning today uh, new stuff, but you gotta take action. You gotta get off the couch. You gotta go place a bandit sign, make that call to the park manager. You gotta take action. 
If you're struggling to start your mobile home business, please feel free to send me an email. Uh, leave a comment below. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, the subscribe button, and uh, stay tuned for my next video about mobile home investing. My next video is gonna be a step-by-step -step guide on how to buy your first deal.